just leave on the other side of the road here. Yeah. Okay. So, what's your name? What do you do? I am a old sailor, retired now. Just come around, watch the sea, and the yeah. uh, folks that pass around. What's That's your name? It. Captain Hall, they call me. Captain Hall. My name is Edward. How long you lived here? Oh, I born here. Born here? Yeah, I born right up there with that trees, above that town, that place. Mm -hmm. But I live all the other islands. I live in the Carib I live in Barbados some years. I spent some time in Grenada. Spent some time in St. Lucia. And I worked on St. Thomas and Tatula. So I've been around a good many years. What's your favorite? My favorite? Yeah. On the sea. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm a seaman. Yeah. Captain, build ships too. And uh, travel a lot. Never been in trouble. It's good. No, I don't, don't know what the law is like. I preach. If you want me to carry from here anywhere, I carry you free. But any come you come and offering money and want to do deals. I do no deals. Never do nothing yet. Have no trouble with the law. It's good. Yeah, no problem. What's uh, you were saying? There was no tourists here. Church. Tourists. No, 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 none of these islands. And a couple of just a few years ago, but there was no tourists in these islands. <laughs> they were all these islands were produced with sugar. But it, let me say from when around in the uh, probably the sixties, the seventies. People just started to go and come. That I didn't have no hotels around. Yes. So it's about, let's say, now we are 10, 12, 14, about 25, 30 years ago, people started coming to these islands. But before then, we shipped the salt, and uh, that was all. Nothing else to do. It was very rough in those days. But now we got a lot of tours, a lot of hotels. You could go to St. Martin, some people go to Guadeloupe, Martinique, and backward and forward. But our trade was salt from here to Trinidad. Mm -hmm. What did you come back with? You go one way with salt? Yeah, we come back with like oil, like the road oil, yeah. and with gasoline, and aviation. In those days, we didn't have tankers. We just bring them down in drums. Huh? How big a boat? Oh, uh, from about... 60. Yeah? 60s. Right, right. 60, 65, up to 90, and uh, so forth. But it was not like now. Didn't see all, no money was stirring around. Even St. Thomas was an American country. Life was hard. Yeah, not no money around these islands. How old are you? 40. Next oh, week. Well, 40 next week. 40 right? in, sorry, how many days? 40 on Monday. Yeah, I'm 82. 82? Yes, sir. Still Looking have good. sex. Nice. Still have sex and love the girls bad. That's all my problem. I love the girls. Never drink. Never drink no smoke. Don't know nothing about going in the court and fighting and all like this. No, no, no about stealing and those things. Long ago, we, long ago I had left my $50 and so when I come back, I'll meet it here. The world, somebody would hold it and say, if you hear somebody say they lost so much and so much money, I have it. That's how we used to live around here. When I go out and I catch a fish, I don't sell it. Give you a piece. When you go out and you kill a goat, you give me a piece. That's how these islands was used to be. But after the Yankee daughter, Yankee dollar started to spin around, things have changed. Better get greedy and then they don't care about each other. No, but before then life was good. Yeah, greed's not good, eh? Eh? It's not good to be greedy. No. I'm greedy. Hmm. No. When I have my ship, because I had one or two of them, and a guy will say, Cap, I want to go down Dominica or St. Lucia. Just tell him, help them work and we go on board. We used to live nice in the Caribbean. Good living, man. That time I know when nobody here, they didn't have no prison. Nobody in good prison. You hear you, you, you break some corn, because we used to plant a lot of corn and peas and rare animals. And uh, body kill a goat, they send you a quarter, when you kill, you send a quarter. These islands was like brothers and sisters living. 
Yeah, St. Martin was the same. We, we go in St. Martin, no, no, nobody asks you no question. They ain't had no immigration those days. <laughs> Just jump on the boat. Where are you going, boy? I go in St. Martin to go in line. We go and buy a bottle of uh, that French wine, Jubilee or Kankina. We just go there and we come back, don't pay nothing. No. Perfect. Oh, yeah, man. Those, we used to live real, real nice around these islands. There was no, uh, it was no police getting involved. Even me, I can send you in my house. Stay right here until you go in the house. Yeah. If I see a strange guy around, I may hide the key and tell you where you could go. But like me, I got, I got all kind of things down here, valuable, and I don't, don't laugh. Yeah. I don't know. That's how it's supposed to be. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, it's supposed to be, but not so anymore. Yeah. We got a lot of strangers coming here, and if you're not working, what are they going to do? They got to steal. You see, but in those days, we didn't have that. But here now, there's lots of work. Big pardon? Big hey, pardon? Here now, there's lots of work, though. Eh? There's lots of work now. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. don't work. No, you don't have... Now, I... I've been in St. Thomas and uh, St. Croix, I used to work. And the money I made here, I couldn't make it in those places. No. But you know, when any tourists come, they come with money. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we got some lovely hotels down here, around here, man. Yeah, rich, rich. Yeah, rich people, you know, yeah. like, like you all. You, huh? You're having a you good, are. You're having a good yes, ball. Sweet. Oh, sweet, good talk. Yes, all right. Yeah, yeah. man, no, I've been here for, we've been here for like two and a half weeks.